evening. Once you learn how to master the ability of just staying calm, staying calm and collected throughout every single minute of your lifetime, not only until I learned how to master this and do it every single day, regardless of what I'm going through, I can be calm even if I'm in an argument, I can be calm at, at work, at the gym, at, on a date with my loved ones, even during a fight, I'm still gonna be calm. Once you learn how to do that, man, once you learn how to regulate your emotions and don't let your emotions take over you, especially as a man, you're gonna start being a superhuman and you're gonna be respected and feared by others. Really, seriously, man, you're, you're gonna be someone that's very scary. You're gonna be extremely scary to other people. You're gonna be very intimidating. You're gonna be very calm and confident because real confidence, man, comes from from within, like, it's a relationship with yourself, like the loudest guy in the room, the guy that's like always yelling and shouting and making himself seen. That's not the most confident person, man. I'm here to tell you that, right? The most confident person is the person that is very calm and collected and focused and doesn't even really speak that much, like, because why would you need to speak that much unless you're having a conversation about a specific subject? So what I'm saying is, you can try it for yourself, but I know for me, man, like, I used to be that guy. I used to be obnoxious and loud and always wanting to have the attention on me, the focus on me, me, me. That's not a good approach because you're just gonna come off as like a little bit douchey and kind of like weird, honestly, man. Like, so recently I started like, now it's subconscious because that's became who I am. But I remember at first I would consciously keep thinking about it. All right, man, calm down, calm down. Stay calm and collected. There's no need to keep yelling and shouting and talking and whatever. Regulate your emotions, be present, be calm, be one with nature, be one with what's around you and connect to it. There's no need to keep yelling and saying words just to say them. So now I approach life in a calm way and I can honestly say, man, I'm happier than ever. Like I'm more relaxed. I'm not as stressed out. I'm not as anxious. I can really focus on focus on things that matter because I decided to calm down. And then, because when you're not calm, like there's a lot of stuff going on in your brain. That's not a good state to be in because you're not gonna have space for important things or creative ideas to come along your way. Everything beautiful, art, like everything you can think about, music, art, all of these things, they come from a place of calmness. Like the artist is usually calm. They usually meditate for X amount of time in order for the ideas to just come to them. Then they go crazy, obviously, and, and do whatever they gotta do to make that a reality. But before that, they obviously had to go through the phase of just being calm and brainstorm so that they, these ideas can just come to them naturally. But if they were in a state of thinking about this, that, and whatever, this, that, and the other thing all the time, and just, oh, there's a lot of clutter stuff going on in your brain. How, how is that? You're never, nothing's gonna come your way. Nothing creative is gonna come your way so you can change your reality. You're not gonna be able to come up with a creative idea. And that's what it's all about, being creative. That's the secret, man. 
Yeah, that's it for the video, man. Hit the thumbs up and I'll see you later.